I am Amanda Trumpower, Christian children's author and co-host of the book podcast for kids, Ice Cream with Authors. Welcome to my series on how to create make your own cards for Yodo. Let's get started. Let's talk about how to convert audio files into an MP3 so you can add it to your make your own playlist. You'll need to open up your file manager, whether that is Explorer or Finder. And you want to go to your downloads folder or whatever folder you're using to store your audio files. As you can see, there's a couple of different file types in my download folder. I have mostly MP3s, but I also have something called a WAV. It's also possible to have a file called AAC. This is often what you find with Apple music purchases. And then sometimes you find a file called M4A. Regardless of what it currently is, the goal is to turn it into an MP3. So now that you're looking at the file that you would like to convert, we are going to open up our browser and we're just going to Google. And in Google, we're going to type convert whatever it is you have, in my case, WAV to MP3. You're going to get a lot of different results. A lot of these will let you convert X number of files for free. And as long as they're going to give you the MP3 when you're done, there's really no wrong answer. The one that I like to use is called Cloud Convert. So you just click on that and you're gonna hit select file here in the middle. You're going to pick out the file that you need to convert. I'm gonna so sort my files by kind first. Here's my WAV file. And then in this drop down box, you can tell it what you want it to convert to. These are all of the possible choices. We want an MP3. And then you hit the red convert button. Now I've actually used this tool multiple times today for other projects. And as you can see, I have reached my daily limit. It will allow me to convert 10 files for free. If I would like to convert more than 10, I would need to purchase the services. I can come back tomorrow, however, and I have 10 free conversions available to me. So this is a good thing for you to see in case you are doing a large number of file conversions. You're either going to need to break it apart into multiple days, or you'll need to find a different service, or you just pay for the tool for a month or whatever amount of time you need to do your project, and then you can always turn it off. Let's pretend that I had not reached my limits for the day. Instead of saying an error right here, it would say success. Your file is ready to download. And this button would be green and it would say download. And you click the button and it appears in your downloads folder. I've already done this step for a different project. So you can see I have the same file as an MP3 already right here in my file. And then at this point, you are free to continue your make your own process. You go back to my.yodoplay.com and you sign in and you select your playlist and you're ready to add audio in the correct file format.